Hey, First Baptist Church Allen family, Pastor Chad here. We're looking forward to Sunday. We're concluding our Revelation chapter 1 series of messages, those last several verses. Last week we left off and John said, he heard a big voice right on a scroll to these seven churches. Well, this week he turns around to see where the voice came from. And what he sees is the exalted Christ. And it's one of my favorite passages in the whole Revelation because in these verses, it's filled with symbols but they're all clear and applicable and a whole lot of encouragement and hope wrapped up in these verses. You don't want to miss this Sunday. It's my favorite out of the series. And uh, be here, be a part of it. Now, I want to remind you of something else happening on Sunday. We call it Marriage Monthly. We have a special time. We're going to be doing some marriage enrichment things, have someone coming in to lead us. And when, when I got married, I made a commitment that I was going to read a book on marriage every year of our marriage. And I've read at least one book. I had a great book I read this year that really encouraged me in some new things and some reminded me of some old things in my marriage. And Rhonda and I like to do something each year that we do as a couple together to enrich our marriage, something intentional. And this is a good opportunity for us to do that here at, uh, around mid-year. And it might be a good thing for you too. I hope you'll join us for our marriage event on Sunday afternoon at four o'clock. I want to point a little bit forward on September the 4th, holiday weekend, Labor Day weekend, and we're gonna have one service. It's a great opportunity. It's not often during the year we get to get everybody together. We're often two churches in one building because we're flip-flopping worship and Sunday school Bible fellowship groups. Well, it's all of us together. We're not gonna do our groups. Uh, we'll have things for preschoolers, but we're gonna to get together and we're gonna to worship together. It's a special time unifying our church around a really important topic on a Labor Day weekend, God's uh, plan for us in the work world. And I think you're gonna find some good things that'll encourage you as you go out to be a missionary wherever God has planted you. Have a good weekend. We're looking forward to seeing you on Sunday.